on Powered Up Mike. And starting things off, a cold breeze whips through the castle. Why? Because you unlocked a door leading to a frosty new course. Wow! I can't believe you beat King Babam in a battle. It looks so hard even reaching him. Let alone boning him like you did. You're my hero! This game is from 2009, so there will be outdated slang terms. So, of course, Nanoba, as I said in the last episode, it's a long gone Flash King site. But of course, back in the day, people said, Mario 63, look it up on Newgrounds. And it's like, and I mean, you're right. Now let me zoom out, see if there's any star coins. No? Okay, we're good. Whoa, that was a brave move. But I mean, Nano Buzz is long gone. They had a great game selection, mainly Mario games. But, and in years past, I did play it on new grounds, like many people did. But most re more recently, I did play this game on Runout, I think that's what their name is, on their website right before, like literally days before Flash shut down. And man, it was a lovely time. That's how I feel about missing that star code. Trying again? Here we go. Just gotta swing. We don't have to break a box this time. Nice! Here we go. Five silver stars. Go. We're doing it. What else? But I mean, I've played this game several times, but... Man, I still remember being a young kid and being surprised to find out that, like, the one game I spent a lot of time into, it's like, oh, the level editor's not complete, and lo and behold, I reached a dead end. But it would still probably be, like, some of the older versions will probably forever be spooky on how, like, they were just incomplete. And this was years before, you know, a full decade before that whole iceberg thing and the Mario 64 leaks and the fake leaks. Gaming has come a long way. It really has. And here I am. No! I didn't want to do that. Oh well. This is kind of a fast-paced game, mind you. Another room is opened in the castle. You'll only see that for a little bit. Collect the eight red coins. For some unknown reason, a shine sprite is formed. And the power star. No question, Mario Logic. Just, just, just don't, man. I really hope these videos come out well. Even though, you know what? With OBS, a modern, fancy laptop, it's kind of, you know, just something alright. I'm, um, you know, playing this game now in 2021 and not 2011. Then again, I didn't have YouTube in 2011. Yeah, this is probably the longest mission in the game. No! No, Bob on Battlefield, I meant. There's plenty of, you know, you have to go far and wide. Mm -hmm. And it just... Oh, man. It just has a story, you know, fun gameplay, beautiful art style. It's like, it just works out so nicely. There it is. Shine Sprite. Can't be the only kid that thought it was Shine Spirit. Yeah, I read things a little too fast when I was young. Secret on a Mountain. Well, that's a secret, in fact. That whether or not I know it is also a secret. By the way, the discussion is also to be kept secret, understand? 
Um, that whole text is gonna be going out to several people online that watch my channel, which is not much. Haha. <laughs> Had to. Plus, we'll get the last star coin. Oof. And that's one of my favorite tricks, this. But man. Even the thing is, the power meter is still, you know, it's restricted here. Yeah, you have to get five coins to restore a slice of health. But even then, the game's pretty easy. And now this is an awesome track. I mean, when I was young, I used to walk to this track. Man, to think that was, you know, 11 years ago. I mean... Okay. And we've collected all the star coins in the bomb battle. Yo. You know, I'm just gonna get to a pause point. One all star coins. Not bad. So let's just. Mm -hmm. And we got it. And that's the first course. <laughs> so we're leaving the in that room. I'm not going to talk to all the toads quite yet, because, well, there are some secrets to do. Now, this is the level design room. Oh, good, we got up here. Yep. Let's see what you have to say, toad. Star coins, or open these doors here. We need star coins, not shine sprites. You to pay for I got a paper cut. Oh man, they sure have heard all right. The level designer, start creating your very own level and share them with other people. Don't take too long, the Mushroom Kingdom still needs saving. Still remember when that one little toady said, can't wait till it's finished. And that paper cut joke kind of flew over my head when I was little. Well, mainly what all the symbols meant. Have you been to the Tidal Isles yet? We just wave sunken treasure and lots of tropical fish. Cool. Let's do it. Bye, cheap cheap. Big tidal wave. Now the one thing is, there is a water, like a breath. Air gauge. Now silver stars do replenish it, but at least it makes the game a little gives it more challenge because in the original game, 64 and 64 DS, yes, just jump in water and you'd be healed instantly. Because it uses the same, you know, mechanics. No, go that way, Mario! Now this star coin has always been tricky. Oh, no, no. no. Of course, you don't want to drown. You know what, I'm going to take Ride You for a faster way out. Yeah, this... Probably the most annoying star coin in the game. Well... Oh, we got it. Don't worry, Mario. We'll get you out of here soon enough. But, it's kind of like that one, uh, secret level in, um, 64DS, but hey, easy one. You have enough strength rights to open another door. Maybe this one will lead to Bowser. You have time for, I guess, maybe a few more. What do you have to say? Yes, I can finally see someone else other than me! Shifting Sandland. And that's the pyramid from Desert Land in Mario Bros. 3, the All-Stars hey, version. The Koopa Pharaoh, you's gonna die. Yeah. Oh man, this I found... When, well, like in the Gajillions of Beta versions this game had, I thought this was the spookiest level, because how it 
you know, there was nothing. You couldn't enter the pyramid. It was all empty, and, it, and that Mario Galaxy, you know, desert music didn't help matters. But here it is. Don't worry, we almost got ourselves some flood. I think. Wee! On my way, Koopa. But the fun part is, you really can whip through this game. Okay, so, 11 minutes in, minus scenes I take out. Get the star coin first. Yay, double digits! You just unlocked the grass tile set for the little designer. Here's another obscure story. I read that in my second grade teacher's voice, and I still have. Don't ask why. I think we got time to finish these, you know, red, this area. Let's track for the eight red coins. I need that. Of course, there's some ruins that have yet to be found. 12 star coins. I mean, there's I mean, the platforming, it's quick and fun. Oopsies. I don't know what else to really say for now, but trust me, there's gonna come plenty of stories in. I mean, following in traditional Mario manner, the desert world is always the second world. Always. Backyard of the castle has been opened up. Maybe you can visit Peach's Garden. There might be a shine sprite there. Well, not now. Shining atop the ancient pyramid. This is gonna be a quick level. We're just gonna spin our way down. You don't need to do- why do all that tricky platforming when you can do that? And that's all for this video. See you next time. Bye bye <laughs>